Smallmouth bass often have a reputation for being ferocious feeders, lashing out at baits like a school of hungry piranha. Ah, <laughs> buddy, get a double header. <laughs> wow, look at that guy there. That can be the case when the water is extremely cool or extremely warm. But what about the time in between? Believe it or not, sometimes smallies can be very selective in their feeding habits, biting as light as a feather and being tougher than a stubborn mule. Whoa, huh? Look at that. That's a nice fish. Another nice, nice, nice bass. Wow, 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 wow. Boy, this lake has some real horses in it. Holy smokes. Come here. Oh, stop, there we go. I got him. Look at that, huh? Pretty one. Is that a horse? So hey, when you're heading out on the water to do a little fishing, you got your tackle box packed with maybe some crankbaits, a few jerk baits, of course, some soft plastics, maybe even a few topwaters. What do you think about when it comes to picking the right lure for the right situation. Well, a lot of it comes down to the current environmental conditions, the weather conditions, and what kind of mood the fish happen to be in. Today, Jim and I are out targeting smallmouth bass, and we're targeting them with soft plastics. And the idea of today's show is all of the new rigging, jig designs, hook designs, and weight systems that are available for delivering soft plastic baits to big brown bass. This is gonna be a fun day. As we said, there's really a wide range brownie. of lure presentations to catch moody smallies in spring. Today, we're focusing on soft bait presentation tactics. For a fast moving horizontal presentation, the VMC drop dead hook rigged with a five inch Trigger X minnow is a good option. They come in various weight sizes to fish various depth ranges. Another great way to fish a minnow profile is to simply nose hook the bait with a VMC wacky hook. This combination incorporates a really slow drop speed with erratic behavior. For bottom fishing, the standard 4 inch tube rigged on a VMC finesse jig head is hard to beat. The VMC rugby head has a really unique design. We usually use this with a tube profile or a twin tailed grub. This combination is really amazingly snag resistant. Last but not least is a weighted VMC wacky weedless jig. We'll usually rig this with a four inch Trigger X flutter worm. Simply cast it out, let it sink to the bottom. At times when smallies are really in a negative mood, it can be the only way to trigger strikes. Wow, look at him, whoa, look at this, wow. Whoa, 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 hey bud, come here, oh yeah. Look at that. That is a really, really, really sporty smallmouth. Really, really nice fish. And you know, when it comes to catching lots of fish and having lots of success, a lot of it can come simply down to the terminal side of what you're doing fishing with the right style jig, the right weight, the right hook design. It can all add up to big payoffs like a bronzy like that. Great fish.